Hi everyone, I'm Andre Longanu, one of the learning partners from TikTok Shop. Welcome to our course on navigating the TikTok Live dashboard. This tool is essential for analyzing traffic, conversions, product performance, and promotions for your live streams with real-time adjustments. There are two versions, basic and advanced. Let's explore them together. To access the live dashboard, go to TikTok Shop Streamer Desktop. If you are currently live, go to the live console and click the monitor icon at the top right to open the live dashboard. For past recent streams, navigate to the live analytics tab. In the all live videos section, click details for specific streams, then open the live dashboard from the top right. Let's start with the basic version. By default, you'll land on the advanced version. To switch to basic, click the button next to live console and select basic. Here are the key features of the basic version. In the top left corner, you'll see the creator's handle, live stream start time and duration. In the center of the page, you'll find core metrics like GMV, views, product clicks, enter room rate and new followers. You can customize which metrics to display by clicking metrics and you can show up to eight at a time. In the lower middle section, you'll see the product list which shows all featured products. You can sort by indicators like CTR, click through rate, or SKU, stock keeping unit orders. Configure more indicators by clicking metrics and search for products by name. On the top left, there's the GMV trends section, which displays minute level trends for GMV and SKU orders, indicating pace of orders generated from the live. You can adjust your strategy in real time by analyzing these metrics. Below that is the viewer source section, which shows where your traffic is coming from, including organic and promoted sources. You can access traffic source definitions at the top. Below the viewer source section, you'll find the live viewer and buyer profiles. Buyer data appears once you have more than 500 viewers, while viewer data is available regardless of traffic count. This section provides details like gender, age, and region to help analyze your target audience. On the right side, starting from the top, you can change the display language, download the data into an Excel worksheet, and access full screen mode. The viewing and engagement trends section shows traffic patterns such as global unique viewers, viewers starting to watch, and viewers leaving the stream. Engagement trends provide by the minute level data for views, comments, and shares. Violations are marked on the trend chart to help analyze their impact on traffic. Be sure to review the Policy Center in TikTok Shop Academy if you have any violation questions. Below the Viewing and Engagement Trends section is the Replay section. This lets you monitor the live stream with comments or switch to only display comment mode. When the live is over, you can still see the live recap for up to 14 days. Now let's explore the Advanced Live Console. In the Central tab, you'll find 16 key metrics for live streaming. To choose which ones to display, click the button in the top right corner. Metrics are divided into four categories, GMV, traffic efficiency, transaction, and ads. This version includes more ad-related features, perfect for tracking ad performance. Click any metric to see a dynamic trend chart of events during the live stream. If you need benchmarks, click create target to set and customize your targets. In the bottom right corner of the central tab, the info tab lays out a timeline of events, including pinned products, promotion tools, ads, and violations. In the lower half of the live board, you'll find four main metric categories. The product section is similar to the one in the basic version. The traffic and conversion section shows overall traffic sources, views, CTR, and click to order rate across traffic sources, helping you understand how your traffic converts into sales. Violation, which is sorted by time, and you can track them during and after your live stream. The promotion section displays view UV, unique viewers who watch the content, Click UV, unique viewers who clicked on the link and join UV, unique viewers who join the event, showing the effectiveness of your promotions. In the top right corner, you can check out the total trend graph. While streaming, you get real-time updates for the most recent five minutes. Right below that, the replay section lets you monitor comments in real time. To summarize, the basic version is ideal for personal hosts, offering simplified data and core metrics. The advanced version is suited for experienced teams, providing enhanced insights, additional analytics, and real-time execution. It includes detailed metrics for deeper analysis and improvements. Thanks for joining us today. In the next lesson, I'll explain which live dashboard metrics to focus on and how to improve them. Stay tuned.